Hey friends, I have a Costco haul for you today. We ran in there after a bank appointment and we picked up some things and I thought I would share with you what we picked up. If you can hear something kind of going in the background, I've got some ground beef on the stove. We're having tacos tonight um, and it's kind of loud, but I need to get this film so I can get everything put away. So we're multitasking at best. Here we go. Okay, so this is my pan for my ground beef. There it is, cooking away. Um, we got some bacon. So normally we get the maple flavored Kirkland brand bacon, but we have been getting um, this regular kind, just naturally smoked, and it's been really good. So we've been kind of getting that lately. Um, we got some green beans, and then a big thing of Parmesan petals. I really love these for salads. Um, I still like to get the ground up kind of like green can, if you will, um, Parmesan because it makes a good filler instead of breadcrumbs if you're doing like keto or um, Trim Healthy Mama. Um, but I do really love these for salads. We also got some marble cheese and I got the kiddos some um, sprouted bread. I have made our own bread for the last little while, but I was just feeling like I needed a break. <laughs> so um, we picked up some of this. And we got a bag of broccoli florets. The price on this was, I think it was like four or five dollars. And to have everything already chopped up, and I, I think it's pre-washed, but even if things are already pre-washed, I always wash them anyways. And there, I think feel like there have been way too many outbreaks of pre-washed vegetables and things um, for me not to pre-wash. But anyways, um, I get a lot of bang for my buck, I find, with this as opposed to just buying a broccoli broccoli um, at the grocery store. Because I generally kind of, I don't use the stem very much, like so a lot of that goes to waste. And these are all just florets, so I'm not dealing with the stem and dealing with the waste. So anyways, that's my two cents on that. Um, I'm pro I'll probably buy regular broccoli again. It's, this is not like a total switch or anything like that, but... Um, it just was a good bang for my buck for what I could get at Costco versus the grocery store. Is that enough about broccoli? Okay, let's move on. Um, I got some applesauce cups. We are officially out of our homemade applesauce um, that I canned, and um, I really like to have this as a side for the kiddos. This is unsweetened, and they're in a bunch of different flavors, and this is the French side showing, and I do not know French very well. So there's apple strawberry apple peach and mango just plain apple apple and raspberry and apple and blueberry um, and again there are no sugar added and no artificial colors and flavors so i like that um we got this big jar of nuts i already got into it and had a little handful um those are good and some baby spinach a big container of dill pickles so this big old container is a better price by far than what i can get at the grocery store the grocery store container is a lot smaller, and I did get an off-brand, like a no-name, it's actually called no-name brand here in Canada, and the pickles were not good. Um, they were in a big jar like this, but they were not at all good, so I got them at Costco, and they were five bucks, and much better price than what I can get at the grocery store. Um, I got some apple cider vinegar, and this is... Um, organic and it's with the mother so if you're getting apple cider vinegar I highly recommend getting the mother with your apple cider vinegar um, because some don't have it some are don't have the mother and the mother is what gives you all of the good health benefits of apple cider vinegar we got um, a two pack of eggs and two heavy whipping creams and some bananas Okay, so over here, as I mentioned, I've still got um, the regular um, Parmesan cheese, like the grated kind. Again, this is good as a filler. It's really good on things like spaghetti and meatballs. Um, Y'all know about Parmesan. <laughs> um, two packs of butter. And then I got a three pack of cucumbers. Um, we also got some Greek yogurt. We always get this. Um, and then a some of these fruit cups. These were on sale and there's 20 of them and they're they are the fruit salad. They also had peach peaches like diced peaches and mandarin oranges. My son will not eat mandarin oranges. He won't eat oranges in general. He just sucks the juice out. So even though they were on sale, he wouldn't eat them. So I just I, it's not worth it to me. Um, and we had had some peaches that from that we got from Walmart. So um, we got fruit cups this time. 
And I like to have this fruit on hand because I don't like to, I'm trying not to buy off season. So for us, berries won't be in season for a while. Let me show you my face while I talk. Berries won't be in season for a while. Um, and I don't want to spend a lot of money on produce that's not in season that has been kind of ripened in a truck. Um, so, you know, we're just, we're doing the best that we can. Fruit cups, maybe not the healthiest choice. I don't know. Um, but I am just trying to eat more seasonally. And um, in doing that, sometimes we pr rely more on frozen fruit and these little fruit cups. And either way, I do like to have that kind of stuff in my pantry. If the power were to go out or something like that, um, which is not at all a stretch <laughs> for the time of year that we're in. Um, so I do like to have some kind of things that we could just open up and eat and not have to worry about electricity. You know what I mean? Okay, so this is um, a buy that my husband picked out. This was um, some summer sausage. And then the kiddos love, love, love these salamis. Like, they begged to get these. Um, we like to slice them up for lunches. And they're, they're really, really good. Um, but yeah, they were super thrilled to have that. And we got some Dev soap. My husband likes to use bar soap. Um, I, my grandmother used Dev soap pretty much as long as I can remember, since well before I was born. I don't know how old Dove the brand is, but I feel like I want to say she used it all her life. Um, and even when she was in a nursing home, the nurses commented to my mom about how nice my grandma's skin was. And my mom said it, all she's ever used is Dove soap. So Dove holds a little special place in my heart because it reminds me of my grandma. She used to actually keep lots of bars like in a jar or um, a bowl in her bathroom. So always reminds me of her. Then we got the kiddos some Crocs. These will actually probably go in their Easter baskets. Um, we love these shoes for the summer. And um, they are so nice because they're easy to kick on and kick off. Um, they can be thrown right in the washing machine or hosed off with a garden hose. They are great for playing in the mud, for playing in the garden, for doing all of the outside things. Um, they, my kids just really love them. So they're a great summer shoe. So this is my, the pair for my son. And then this is the pair for my daughter. They are so cute. And lastly, we got um, the Mary Poppins Returns um, Blu-ray DVD. And we saw this in the theater. I'm a huge Mary Poppins fan. Um, and we wanted to get this when it came out because we love it. So we're gonna have a movie night tomorrow night. We also picked up um, dog food and paper towels. So those are probably still in the truck because mom had to run in and get dinner together. And my husband took all the dogs out for a run and he's got the truck with them. So anyways, that is my Costco haul. I hope y'all are doing well and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.